Hey there, McOwner here, and I'm here today with some XCOM Chimera Squad. So this is the latest game in the XCOM franchise, and it's pretty interesting. It's set after XCOM 2, and now basically aliens and the humans are kind of have like this, I guess, kind of uneasy peace going on now because they're all integrated together, but there are still some... I guess, you know, some organizations, some groups that are still causing issues and stuff. And basically, your squad isn't like a fully customizable squad as far as I know, but it's, it's made of an elite squad of all different types of the alien, like, species, including humans and all this other stuff. Um, I haven't played this yet. I haven't really watched anybody play it yet, so we're going into this pretty much blind. And what's probably going to happen is we're gonna go. I'm gonna I'm gonna start and I'm gonna do an Iron Man mode, whatever, so that you know no safes coming or whatever. And we're gonna go as far as we can until we get to a point. If we can't beat it, we, it's like until we get to a point where we you know we we can't really continue. Um, but most likely. After I play this for a bit, uh, I'm going to be probably playing off stream, like on a different save, just so I could like play like a normal game and just get through the story. But anyways, we're just gonna jump in now and see. So story, games narrative. No, we're gonna do it on normal mode though. I don't want to do like the story mode. We're gonna do it on normal for um for this run. We're gonna do Iron Man. Wait, what's hardcore do? Failing any mission results in total campaign loss. Campaign save is deleted upon failure and cannot be continued. Hmm. Huh. Well, failing any mission? Weird. Uh, failing mission. Oh, failed missions must be restarted. Wait a minute. Yeah, I guess this is different than the original XCOM. Single save does have an image of Field missions must be restarted. In an Iron Man game, your choices in a concert are permanent. Hardcore. So you can, it seems like you can only do hardcore or Iron Man because if you fail, the game's over. It'll just delete your save. I don't want to do that. To uh, tutorial, subtitles. Heal between encounters, half heal. Sure. We'll just keep it at base and then fail mission must be restarted so then should I do Iron Man or Hardcore? Interesting. Well failing any missions means total campaign loss. It's not like the one where it's like your characters just die. Um, but I, at this rate I don't even know like I guess I think oh, when I remember I, I did watch the trailer I guess if any of the characters die die uh, the game's over anyway so I will just do Iron Man we'll see what's going on with this this is not quite the same as the other XCOM games but we'll see two minutes out hey godmother is this like the old days XCOM swooping in and taking it to the bad guys I wouldn't know I spent most of the war training resistance networks. Like mine. And for your many, long years of service. Watch it. XCOM attaches you to an untested squad and pushes it into the field before it's ready. How is this not like the old days? I'm just happy to be here. I missed out during the war. I wish I could have pulled my weight. For which side, exactly? I find that very hurtful. <laughs> sure thing, Advent. <clears throat> <clears throat> we are through the checkpoint. I was never actually Advent. But they were fitting you for a blocky helmet. Stow it, both of you. We're here. 3 1 PD gave us the all clear. Grab your gear and prepare to move in. Hmm. Alright, let's see what this is all about. Whisper, what's your status? And what's Verge's ETA? Comms are working, obviously. Verge is en route. How? Verge can't drive. He, uh, he hailed a cat. <laughs> to a hostage situation? Focus. Well, you gotta do what you gotta Whisper. do. <laughs> Any surprises in the next room? 
A handful of hostiles, unaware of your approach. Chimera squad, take positions. Prep for breach. Okay, breach mode. Chimera squad brings every mission by setting up the breach points to get to jump on enemies. Preview the enemy presence at each breach point and the modifiers will be applied. Then assign agents to the available slots to determine the order they'll enter the fight. Okay, let's see. Okay, I, I guess there's only... Okay. Well, hmm. Okay, can you put it in there? Uh, wait. Hmm. Okay, so I guess he's gonna kick in the door and then these guys are gonna fire. Um, can I see the stats of these guys? I guess not yet. I, maybe it doesn't matter as much. So, breach! 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 Ooh, breach fire thing. Cycle through targets with the tab and left shift. There. Okay, we'll just shoot you then. Boom! Eat it. Ooh, crit, and you can get this guy. Get wrecked. Hello, I am Mayor Nightingale. Is hmm. that our hostage? Welcome to City 31's Memorial Museum. It's just a recording. As I often say, the lessons from our past inform the present. Blah, 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 history. Focus. Okay, turns are moving. Agent and enemy signature turns one at a time, their current place. Yeah, because it's not all group, all in one group goes at once. You now it switch, switches between the player and the enemies. Let me see. Agent and enemy signature turns one at a time, their current place in the turn order can be seen on the unit flag above their head and next to their portrait and timeline, which both update after each turn. Agents have two action points each turn to use for movement, shooting, and ab or abilities. Look for a blue shield to move into cover for defensive bonuses for shooting or move out to flank the enemy for a better chance to hit. Okay. Movement to covering you. Hmm. Think. Okay, yeah, so I have to go. Can I go up here? Oh, that's dashing. Dang, that won't be enough to shoot. So... Sure. Cover me! Get a move on! Six ability from the ability bar to open it. Okay, wait. Let's overwatch. Okay, I didn't get the cell. We'll go for this guy. Hey! Ooh, you missed. He didn't move though. Hmm. It's dashing. Okay, this is not the best. <laughs> I don't even know if I have... No, I don't have line of sight there. Uh... Ah, sh screw it. Fire! I know this is not the best thing. It's only 50%. Yep. Okay, now I can try to get into a better spot here. Like, if I fire here, it's 59%. I wonder if it's gonna make me Shifting miss position. both these Good shots fall. on purpose. Hmm. Oh, oh, it's my turn again. Nice. Okay. 
So Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna go right up into your face and close, blast okay? your head off. <laughs> you see this? Huh. Oh crap. Oh. Huh. Clear. Nice. Merch? Ah, what took you so long? Had to unpack a breaching charge. Good man. Not exactly. You know what I mean. I always do. So creepy. Don't ever change. Verge, form up. Any hostiles in the next room? Yes. I can feel them. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Another breach. Okay. Multiple breach points. Turn over. Some counters can more than one breach point with risk and benefits. <coughs> Different risk and benefits. Consider whether to split the squad or send them all through the same locations. Agents entering from the same breach point will encounter that will enter the counter together and be closer in the timeline. The order of the breach points will enter is shown next to their name and can be changed using the arrows. Okay. Oh, okay, so you can change... Okay. Agent damage is likely. Closely watch enemies deal plus one damage during the breach. Celia, last unit does three damage during the breach. Okay. So... So, let's... You here, door. You've got a shield, so let's do that. And then you, I think that's. I'm hoping that's their health, so we'll put you in there. And then put the godmother here. I'll put Verge here. Let's see how that works. Stay behind me. Breaching. So, oh, so, oh, there's one over there. That's why. Oh, God, there's a lot. Anyways, we'll go for the 100%. So, fire. Ooh. 91, 79. Okay, we'll take you out, hopefully. Oh, Grays. Dang. Okay. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Curious if we should go for the guy. No, let's go for the ones that have the most percentage right now. Ooh, eat it. Yeah, let's see. I think. Yeah, he's got the best shot on that guy, so we'll take him out. Hey. Ooh, okay. Each, been, each agent has a unique ability they can use every turn, gradually gaining more abilities from their class and equipment. Most agents also have the subdue ability, a non-lethal attack that is low damage but guaranteed the hit. Use it to earn additional rewards for certain mission objectives. Cherub uses the charge bash ability instead of subdue. Okay. Hmm. This is okay. So that's uh, um, clear the okay. So that's I don't see any bonus things. Okay, let's. Get him behind. Oh, okay, I can't go there. So yeah, we can get him behind some cover here at least. And we'll fire. Who is? Okay, you're next. So I should probably take him out, and then I can have. Because then it would should be. Yeah, now it's her turn. I can move her over here. And then fire. Take this guy out. Hey. This guy's turn, though. I didn't really have a good shot. Oh! Well, then. We're just gonna move over here. Changing position. And take him out. Hey.
Set up the breaching charge. Ooh. I do like to make an entrance. Breach mode. Some breach points can be accessed with special equipment or abilities. Once an agent with their required asset is in the first slot, other agents can be assigned. Okay. So only only Cherub can do this one. All non-aggressive enemies guarding this entrance are surprised. Okay. There. Have birds go third. And there we go. Let's try this. Wait, hold. Hostage confirmed in the next room. Well, th you we go, need yeesh. more than that. Yeesh. Free one PD has a live feed. Patching through. Great. If you surrender, I will advocate leniency. Enough. This exhibit. It is about XCOM's role in our liberation. I see you read the placard. It doesn't say how they went soft and got weak. Now, it's up to us to <sighs> light the spark. He's holding a detonator. Oh god. Go, now. Okay, well. How's this for an entrance? Okay, let's see. So that's a hundred. Hundred. Nine, okay. Fifty-eight. Okay, there's five? It's probably just go for one of the hundreds. Fifty-eight, fifty-six. Okay. Slightly more percentage on this one for Verge. Got him. Nice. Okay. Sixty-one. Okay, we'll go for the 61 then. Wait, what is it? I thought it was a different text there. But anyways. Ooh! Nice. Oh, there's a... Hmm. Hunker down. Uh... Nightingale. Okay. I'll protect you. Oh, Jones what? Down. Okay. Yeah, that was All meant in. to happen. Verge, with me. Protect the mayor. Confirmed. Because this is tutorial, so that was meant to happen. Agent Lizzoli will be bleeding out. Indicated by the number. The mission will fail unless the agent bleeding out is saved with stabilizer ability or the encounter is completed before the timer expires. Uh. Okay, so I guess I gotta go over here and stabilize. Okay, well, I can just use... Yeah, stabilize. Yeah, stabilize him. Okay. Cool, I can still fire, though. Or should I overwatch? Hmm. Fire! Damn it! Go after this guy. Take out this one. This is only this is only half cover, but then I can hit that guy. He doesn't go next anyway. But I don't even know if I can kill this guy. Okay, let's go over here and take this All guy out. Keep to cover. Nice. Nice, I crit. Cherub, are you still with us? Yeah, I uh, think so. Only thing injured is my pride. And your diaphragm. And a few ribs. None of this should have happened. Most people say thank you. I'm, I'm grateful, of course. But these people don't have the capability mm. for any of this. Explain. I read their threat assessment. A month ago, these insurgents 
were all talk and no capability. The greatest threat they posed was to bottles of alcohol. Why tell us? Why now? City 31 shows the world how humans, hybrids, and aliens can keep a lasting peace. I'm the public face of this. Tonight, someone wanted what I represent to go up in flames. We're not in town for local intrigue. I know. But right now, you're the only ones I'm certain are fighting for that same peace. Can I count on your support? Yes, ma'am. I am once again asking for your support. <laughs> okay, um... So you're whispering your whisper here. Hey, baby, we're gonna need a debrief. Rating is good. Package delivered to 31PD. She truly believes what she says. That's why she's in charge. Not too shabby for our first official mission. Don't do that. Don't do what? Celebrate before a mission is complete. It's... Ooh. It's bad luck. Well then. That's not good. <laughs> at City 31's Memorial Museum. The identity of her assailants is unknown at this time. The City Council asks citizens to remain... So she gets vaporized the same day XCOM sends Chimera Squad to our city? You hear that voice in your head? That's me telling you to wake up! Despite opposition, Mayor Nightingale's deciding vote brought the Reclamation Agency to the city. Without her support, Chimera Squad's continued presence is an open question. <sighs> that sucks. Welcome home, Chimera Squad. The director wants to speak with us. Thanks for getting the mayor killed. Also, you're fired. <laughs> That's not helpful. You're right. I'm sorry. I'll patch the call through when you're ready. I followed your action at the museum and its aftermath. Director Kelly, I take full responsibility for what happened. Stop. I sent you to City 31 because I believed you were ready. Tonight, you surpassed my expectations. 31 PD requested help within three hours of your arrival in the city. You answered immediately. Going in, you were under-equipped and down an agent. You adapted, as we trained you to do. And let's not forget, you rescued the mayor. You delivered her to safety as the city requested. Don't blame yourself for an outcome you couldn't control. Instead, let's focus on what's next. I set up the map table. Ready when you are. Head over there. I'll hold. Mm, okay. Let's see. Oh, I can't save the game yet. Okay. Let's see, there is a critical turret waiting on the city map. Okay. Welcome Keek. to City 31. During Advent's occupation, the city was a fortress supporting an active starport. Five years after XCOM won the war, it's okay. So it's been aliens, five years since XCOM alike. 2. Then there's new industry, self government, and local agriculture to support the varied populations. Against all odds, this city thrived after the war. There were no retributive attacks until tonight. We don't know that, not yet, but we can find out. 31 PD requested our help sifting through evidence at the Memorial Museum. They lost good officers today. Give them what they need and see what we can learn. Okay. Map is where we see the status of Stage 31 and any current targets we can set our squad to respond to. Chimera squad can respond to one target per day, after which the day automatically advances. Targets come in two types. Missions are tactical targets. The squad will go into this go into combat on these. Situations are strategic targets. The squad takes care of these without entering combat. Current targets change every day, so watch the city carefully for new priorities. All right. View the situation in the downtown district. Okay. Memorial Museum aftermath. 31 PD needs help pouring through the aftermath of tonight's attack. Mayor Nightingale's death has the city on edge. Let's do what we can to help. All right. Saying the APC to resolve this situation will automatically advance today. I guess, because there's nothing else to do. 
Narcos, we've done what we can to aid 31 PD. Commissioner Malouf passed along her thanks for helping her officers bear the weight of this attack. Your work with 31 PD opened a few doors. Here's what we know. A crude plasma bomb killed the mayor. The insurgents had no access to materials for that. Does that mean they had outside help? Most likely. There are three groups in City 31 with access to this kind of ordinance. Hmm. Choose a faction to be the investigation target. The target faction cannot be changed until it's resolved. Okay. Wait, no. Well, okay. I can't even read this one. Was it Sacred Coil, I guess? Let me see. A loose network of human scions, their vision for the future is entirely psionic, whether the city wants it or not. Griefing organization of alien scavengers. They have quietly amassed the kind of web tree the commission has mandated to recover. Underground religious movement for hybrids. They preach salvation, but only those who once fought XCOM. Hmm. I'm not leaning towards this one, but with my luck, it probably is them. I'm more leaning to one of these two. Let's look into these guys. Let's look into Sacred Coil. See how that. Sacred how that Coil is. is what happens when former Advent officers find religion, or create one. They claim to be the true path for City 31's hybrids, as long as that path involves armed sedition. Director, these are local criminals. Isn't that 31 PD's jurisdiction? True. The Reclamation Agency supports local police, but we're also required to recover dangerous material. From those who would do the world harm, and each of those groups is neck deep in the stuff. So what next? Focus on a single group. Investigate, dismantle their operations, and take them down. Meanwhile, we look for any links to the mayor's death. Either way, a dangerous organization is off the streets. Exactly. The city wants justice for Mayor Nightingale. This is how we help them achieve it. Hmm. Okay. Tackling investigations. Every inv investigation has three stages. <coughs> stages. Groundwork from this first mission. Learn about the f faction and their methods. Operations hidden missions that must be revealed, then completed to knock out the faction's main plans. Take down, stop their final attack, and end their threat to City 31. Okay. Interesting. Active operation investigate sacred sacred coil. Know about sacred coil before we proceed with our investigation. No dark events. Faction overview. Uh, yeah, investigation open faction leadership. Okay. Visit the assembly area. All right. Check it out. Headquarters sent us an assembly. And with the right patterns, we can build anything. Or hmm. we could with the latest version. What you're looking at is the extremely finicky 2038 model. It'll take time to stress test our patterns, but once we have them, we're good to go. Okay, assembly projects are how you get access to new or better items and equipment. Each project can unlock new items for XCOM supply, new weapons or armor upgrades, or a variety of other useful things. Agents aside, here decrease the time it takes to complete a project. All right. Lyrium is one of the three resources Reclamation requires is spent to complete projects in the assembly. Select and start an assembly project. Okay. I just, looks like there's probably only one we can do, so, so it's the Android one. Construct the Android Ops Hub. This network allows us Androids. Okay, so it's basically, yeah, that, that Android unit. Okay. Yeah, I did that. So I guess we'll go back to the city map. Oh, can I click on this? Huh, armory is where you manage your agents. Loadout, manage weapons. Armory agent abilities, unlock new abilities by promoting agents that have earned up EXP. EXP, <laughs> XP, I'm so used to that. Um, Biography, tent armor. <laughs> so that's the customization. The director yeah. convinced hmm. the city council we're too understaffed to be effective. This means we can bring more agents to City 31. Select it's not the whole squad, not yet, but it's something. Hmm. So let's see. Select one agent to join patchwork. Utility of electronic disruption. Change the only. Hack door. Hmm. 
Shrapnel bomb. We already have a guy that can breach. So I'm leaning towards buying, okay, patchwork or torque. Hmm. Moving alias enemies. Hmm. Mobility, health, aim. I think we're gonna... We're gonna go with patchwork because the hack door seems. I'm leaning more towards like the hack door stuff, the hacking stuff. Patchwork. When did you get in? Not so long ago. What's wrong? I specked out a whole workshop for our field office. Which is currently sitting in a warehouse while they finish the building. I'm sorry. I'll be fine. I just need to find a place to tinker. Pick any open floor space. There's so much of it. Okay. <laughs> So we have another extra agent. That's good. Oh, um, I guess I could put, I could put, she's idle, so I could put her there. And yeah, I'll lower it by a day, which is good. Oh, she got something to tinker with. So, we got that going. City map, let's see. There's a critical combat mission target available. Okay. Can I save yet? Nope, it's not letting me save. Or is that? Oh wait, no. I think because I did Iron Man, there is no, there is no. It's, it's auto saving. Duh. That's why I'm, I'm an idiot. Okay. Um, well, I hope it saved because I think. Yeah. So we got through the first mission and got through all this stuff. Mm, yeah, I think I'm going to call. I'm gonna I'm gonna call that uh, the the video here. So yeah, it's interesting. I did get a little bit of a taste for it. I haven't gotten really into the big meat of the game yet. I don't think I got a tutorial mission done. But uh, we're gonna call it here. I think I'm gonna continue on with this. Um, so we're gonna get another video out when I can. But anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, subscribe. It helps me out. Uh, if you want to keep up with everything I do. You follow me on, also follow me on Twitch and Twitter. Um, but until next time, take care, guys.